Ellison 90.7 WGCC. What you just heard was Nirvana Come As You Are and before that, Staring at the Sun by U2. And you listen to the J Red Show on 9.7 The Music FM. Here's, the, here's an interesting proposal from the NBA. What if we started to reseed? What if, so not, not reseed, um, what if the, they, when we went with a 1 to 16 seed, seed? I mean, in the NBA, it's 1 versus 8, 2 versus 7, 3 versus 6, 4 versus 5 in each conference. What if the conferences were just only used for the regular season, but for the playoffs, it was just the top team in the NBA versus the 16th team, 2 versus 15, just all one seed, one, one in the 16th seed? Honestly, I would like that. Now, granted, I want it would have to be two home games, three road games, then two home games for the top seed, because the big concern is that like, what if like Golden State faces Miami, or what if New York faces Los Angeles? You gotta make a three thousand mile trip each way. You gotta make a few, but I think it will create some more interesting NBA matchups. I mean, one problem we have with hockey is that, like, if you're the St. Louis Blues and you have you have a great re- you have a great w- record, you're a contender to, f- to compete for the Stanley Cup, but then you face Chicago, who's also equally good. All of a sudden, all that you you have a quick one and done, and you're out of the playoffs early. I think the NHL should consider doing a one to sixteen seed as well. So, what are your thoughts on that? Hit me up on Twitter at JRed Show for Anyhow, um if you have any I guess the NBA is gonna come to Seattle. Um they're not no they're not coming not bring a team back, but there's gonna be a Gold State Warriors versus Sacramento Kings preseason game. I believe this is the first NBA game in Seattle since the Sonics moved to Oklahoma City in 2007-2008. Um, Seattle could use another team for its winter time, but the NHL could be is, looks like it's going to get there first. I mean, they have to try to build a new arena. Not sure if the key arena um, can support any sports teams anymore. Let's see. Yeah, the key arena is, like, is, six, is um, was founded in 1960. So, it is starting to get pretty old. So, could I think CL could definitely go for an NHL or an NBA team. I'm not sure they can get both, but it would be great for them if they could get both. So, what do, what do you think? Could will CL get NHL? Will they get NBA? Um, will they get both? Will they become the next four sport town? Uh, you look at all. I'm I'm really surprised that Seattle is not a four sport town. Um. Well, the NHL is probably, probably going to be expansion. They're probably going to have a 32 team league, just like the an NFL. Um. If there's any movement, I think it'll be Ottawa moving to um, Quebec. Some kawaii trade ideas. Ah, my laptop's messing up. No, I don't want to hear about JetBlue. Oh, that's not that's not an advertisement. Um, seems like Kawhi might be on his way out. What are some of the possibilities to help the Spurs get something of value? I think the Spurs should consider Hayward if he gets back to form next season. He fits better than Kawhi, who benefited from Duncan mostly. Hayward is not a selfish player as a versatile scorer. Um, maybe a Brooklyn pick plus Kevin Love. I would do this. Love can play in the paint like he used to in Minnesota. The Spurs with a lottery pick would be dangerous. The wait for Clay Thompson to leave him and sign on a max contract. Um, who's five years, um, what are your thoughts on basketball, Bills, Sabres, Amherst, anything, hit me up on Twitter at JRedShow. 
I didn't see the women's Olympic finals yesterday, but I do love watching women's hockey. It's really grown on me. I seen a lot of end up. I seen a Buffalo Buttes game from the NWHL, and I'm hoping they can become the next WNBA if they if they and become um a big deal. I mean, I never expect them to become a major sport like the NFL, NHL, MLB, or NBA. But I do expect the NWHL to become something major around here. But what are your thoughts? Hit me on Twitter at jredshow. And um, come up next is Panic at the Disco by Victorious. Hit me on Twitter for J Red Show for thought for your requests. And this is the J Red Show on 9.7 The Music FM.